Ron, talk about an important event that you remember for the society in its 30-year history. That's a long time, 30 years, but there's a key event that I had the wonderful opportunity to participate in, and it was uh, with the prefecture of Kagoshima. And Governor Sanders had initiated the relationship between Kagoshima Prefecture and the state of Georgia. And so during one of the Japan Southeast U.S. Association meetings, the society uh, went to Kagoshima. And when we got off the plane, there were hundreds of Japanese children singing Georgia songs. And you could have passed out the handkerchiefs to every man there. It was so touching. That evening, it got even better, if you can imagine that. They had koto players, and they played traditional Japanese music for a while. And then they broke into Georgia on my mind with eight koto players. I think we could have done anything between Japan and Georgia on that night. It was truly a magical event, and it's one that I remember vividly. Take two. Because I don't want you to miss anything. Uh, Thank you. Let's uh, see if I can do it again. Yeah. Give me one event that took place in the 30-year history of the Japan American Society that stands out in your mind. Well, 30 years is a long time. But I can remember vividly a single event that happened in Kagoshima Prefecture. As you may know, Governor Sanders initiated sister city relationships between Kagoshima and the state of Georgia. During one of the Japan Southeast Association meetings in Japan, the society and a few other individuals went to Kagoshima. And when we got off the airplane, there were hundreds of Japanese children. And they began to sing Georgia songs. You could not find a dry eye among anyone. In fact, we could have used lots of handkerchief for the men as well as the ladies. That was very special, but the evening was spectacular. They had a show of koto players, six to eight as I recall. And they played traditional Japanese music and they were wonderful. And toward the end of the evening, they broke into Georgia on my mind. And it was better than the Atlanta Symphony. It was touching. You could have done anything between Japan and Georgia on that evening, and it certainly touched everybody that was there. And I think we'll all remember that for the rest of our lives.